Hey guys. Ugh. New video, same fit. Today we have 97s. Uh, silver bullets, another staple, another trash shoe. Both pairs, this and the one, are friends of mine. And I don't think these guys know what they're doing. Alright, I appreciate you doing the intro for me, bro. Oh, what's up, Bubbles? Let me go ahead and get in on this. How you doing? Good, what are you cleaning? Uh, silver bullet Air Max 97s. They're pretty beat, bro. So, uh, second video of the day, huh? Second video of the day. Taking off the load off my back a little bit. Uh, yeah, I appreciate it, man. You know, yeah. it's team, 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 uh, team camaraderie. All right, Johnny, uh, thanks for taking over for me. <laughs> uh, Proud of the couch. What, what are we cleaning today? Uh, we're cleaning the Air Max uh, 97. Oh, wow, these are pretty beat, yeah, huh? Yeah, silver bullets. As you can see, they're a little bit of a brown bullet now. Oh, man. That's, yeah, brown that's bullets. All right, guys, thanks for taking over. I'm going to go ahead and get these. Oh, what are we I cleaning see, right now? I see Haiti uh, coming in. All right, I gotta, get, I gotta get back to my, are, uh, my road size work. Size 13, I'll go ahead and clean these for you. You wanna clean this? Kill it, kill it, kill it. Okay. Somebody. guys, so I'm pretty excited to clean these today. It's uh, my first cleaning video. We're cleaning these Air Max 97s today. These are pretty beat. Looks like uh, Pops might have taken these hiking or something. Pretty excited uh, all right, to do all right, this. Yeah, all right, yeah, sir. Not, not today. Go, get what do you mean? To what, do, what do you Take mean? Get back to work. Let's go. I'm gonna go. clean them. All right, guys. Sorry about that fiasco earlier. Um, so like Hayden said, these are, or was it Johnny? I don't remember. These are a size 13, so we're not gonna be using regular laundry kit. We're gonna be using the XL laundry kit. Now for this bad boy, what we're gonna do is actually go outside and dry brush off some of this dirt. Like I stated before in the Profear video, you do wanna try to remove as much of the dried on dirt and mud as you can before you start cleaning with the water and solution. How hot is it right now? It's hot. It's super hot. If you guys didn't know, we are based in Arizona. It's like 115 degrees outside right now. That's a slight exaggeration. It is probably like 110 though. So now we're back inside from the heat. We're gonna go ahead and start with our soft bristle brush, which we just used for our dry brush. We're gonna dip this into our bowl with some solution. Almost forgot that there. So take our bowl and solution, dip our soft bristle brush, clean this upper. Um, with these silver bullets, it's a combination of like a 3M material, mesh, um, and then just your foam and stuff for your midsole and outsole. Soft bristle brush definitely be the way to go to start out. Uh, 3M is a tricky material sometimes. We do get a lot of questions like I was saying about how to clean it. You use your soft bristle brush, you should be pretty good. This, the material on the silver bullets is a little bit more interesting than some other uh, 3M materials that are on some other shoes. But you should be definitely good with your soft bristle brush. All right guys, so when cleaning the tongues, uh, like I've stated before, I like to use my hand just to put pressure on it just so you can really get this clean. Um, this mesh was pretty dirty up here. So if you just place your hand underneath the tongue, um, whenever you're scrubbing it, it'll allow you to put a lot more pressure on it so you can try to get that mesh clean. Um, these shoes with the upper in general isn't too bad. Like I stated before, it's mainly just 3M and mesh. So you can clean pretty much the entire upper with this soft bristle brush. You wouldn't really have to go back over it with anything else. So we're just gonna clean this bad boy up, and then move on to our all purpose. All right guys, so now we finished up with our soft bristle brush. We are gonna move on to Rejuvenator's all purpose brush. Um, with this, I'm just gonna clean um, the midsoles. This foam, I'm not, I don't think it's painted, but just to be safe, we are gonna use the all purpose for this. So dip that, attack these midsoles. up with our all-purpose like I said I just wanted to use this for the midsole um, surprisingly despite the shoes looking pretty thrashed um, once we dry brush them and clean the upper with a soft bristle the shoes really weren't too bad so just gonna finish up cleaning the outsole with the stiff bristle brush throw these in a laundry bag throw them in the wash and then wrap this bad boy up so let's move on to our stiff bristle brush grab that Cleaner outsole. The outsole on this isn't as bad as the Air Max one was last week. All right, guys, finished cleaning our outsole with a stiff bristle brush. Um, since this does have a black sock liner, we don't really need to go over it too much. Uh, the laundry 
tape will definitely take care of that. Um, so these pretty much look good to go. The one thing I will note that we'll keep an eye on is this like wired mesh material down here. I do know on older pairs, uh, somebody cleaned a pair and said that the wire did kind of rust a little bit. Uh, I don't think it will since this is a newer pair. Uh, I'm pretty sure they probably switched up the material. It's a 2016 pair. Uh, so we'll go ahead and throw in, but that was just something we'll, we'll keep an eye on once they come out to see if that happened. Because like I said, somebody did tell me they washed an 04 pair and uh, this little mesh piece right here, this wire mesh, uh, rusted a little bit, but I think we should be good with these. Um, so let's just go ahead, throw these in the laundry bag. Don't forget to clean our laces once again. So pop these in the laundry bag. Pop our laces in the water and solution mixture. You just want to rub these between your hands like always guys. Uh, another step you can use, which I'll do actually on this time. So one method we do show is just rubbing them between your hands, which you can also do with a soft bristle brush. Um, because of the bristles are really soft for delicate materials, you can clean your laces with that too. So if you just want to get the brush, dump it in your solution and then just scrub your shoelaces with the soft bristle brush. It's another method to cleaning your shoelaces. Cool, so now that we got those cleaned up, let's shake off some of the soap. But we are just gonna pop these in with the shoe. Again, secure the bag, fasten that middle one, lock that down. Tie a knot for double security, just because you don't want the shoe flying out. And like I said, these are a size 13, so with a shoe, any shoe bigger than a 12, even some high tops when you get to like an 11 and a half or an 11, um, you may have to use one bag each for the shoe, but definitely, definitely, ugh, got tongue tied there. Definitely, if it's above a size 12, you are gonna need to put each shoe in its own bag. So now that we got the bag secured, let's go throw these in the laundry. All right, guys. There you go, Ronald. Got the silver bullets. Um, we just pre-treated them. Remember, throw the shoelaces in there. Secure the bag. So you're going to take those, throw them in your laundry, take your uh, good old sneaker laundry detergent. Like always, with this interesting bottle, you do have to squeeze, fill it up to an ounce. Then you can loosen the cap all the way off. Put the detergent on the shoe. That. Make sure your water's secured. So, like I said, guys, last week uh, every washer is a little bit different. Your guys might be different than ours, uh, but always want to make sure uh, small load, normal cycle, no more regular. Like I said, every washer is a little different, and then always cold water, guys. So, after you got that set, hit play, set it, and forget it. We'll be back to get those later. All right, guys, we're back for letting these silver bullets dry. Um, they came out really well, honestly. So the last thing we're gonna do is lace these bad boys up and that'll about wrap up this cleaning. So here we go. Boom, all right guys, went ahead and got these laced up for you. Uh, as you can see, the results speak for themselves. I'm actually really happy with the way these turned out. Uh, Aaron will hit you with them glamorous B-roll shots so you guys can see close up for yourselves. Clean these up today, we used our XL sneaker laundry kit. We also use our soft bristle and stiff bristle brush. Our bowl, of course, like I said in the last week's video, that is one of my favorite products. And the laundry detergent. So you guys can buy all that stuff at rejuvenator.com. Don't forget, we always got our Yeezy giveaway going on. It's a free pair of Yeezys every month, all year long. Make sure you guys enter in the description down below. I'm sure the card will pop up also. Make sure you guys enter if you haven't already. Make sure you guys subscribe if you aren't already subscribed. Leave us a comment down below with some feedback, what you guys thought about this cleaning, what other shoes you guys want us to clean. That's going to be it for this week, guys. Fresh D signing off.